world is coming to. Who put such ridiculous ideas in children's heads? Must be the crop of these modern teachers. There's this particular school in India that I've heard of, the Dhirubhai Ambani International School. They are known all over for putting only the right ideas in their students' heads. Dare to dream, learn to excel is their motto. Education must not be static. It must continuously evolve, they say. And the children, they go revolving around the globe in a mad rush to improve the world, making our lives miserable in the process. Really? Atrocious. I support what the Countess proposed. I haven't really proposed anything as yet, but thank you for your support anyway, Mr. Shifty No Good. I propose that we must get the children to come here. We must tempt them away from their road to perfection and bring them to a palace of temptation. Great idea. We'll grab the kids. Lady Grabber, do not always be so besotted with the idea of grabbing. Be more subtle, more politically correct. We will entice the kids to come here on their own. What idea? But how? India is so far away. I know how. I am in close touch with the dreaded Transylvanian gang of goons, the Chucklehead clan. We will send them, the masters of corruptiness, on our air albatross flight to India. They will waylay the children and induce them to come here voluntarily to our palace of temptation, the place to lead a perfect life filled with candies and junk food, toys and no school. Which child will be able to resist that? Yippee! You are such an admirably evil genius, Countess. Brilliante, Countess Griziola, brilliante! I still think that grabbing works better than molly coddling, but go ahead anyway. I will text them the details of the mission and ask them to report here, ASAP. Done? They should be here shortly. You are so fantastically wicked, Countess. I wish I could be like you. I do. Stick by me, girl, and I will teach you all the trickery that is there to be learned. The true of all the girls.